Take all my pieces, take all my bones, throw them in the sea, throw them in the sea. I said my goodbyes, cut all my strings, to hell with everything, to hell with everything. When I go down, 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 far beneath the ground. I swear, one day I'm going to leave this place. He will not leave me alone. Are you ready for this? Ready for what? Dance. I'm on the freaking dance. Girl, you know I don't dance. I'm gonna drink, you have fun. No. So, not tonight, Abby. I'm about to get a show. Now, now nah, nah, I'm gonna grab a drink. You, you go on. Five months. Let's go take some shots. Follow me to the bathroom. Well, I wonder how good this is. Came from a new supplier. New connection, new town. What do you think, Gen? How's the color looking? Heidi, you are so paranoid. You just need to learn to relax and enjoy yourself for a change. Here, give it to me. I'll test it. Some good stuff. I'm definitely awake now. I told you it was good. Mm. Wait. Ivy, you promised you would dance with me tonight. 
I'm not a great dancer like you are. I look like an idiot. It's a rave club. I'll teach you how to dance. Just, you need to learn to loosen up. Fine. Can we get a drink first? Mm, sure thing, babe. But then you're dancing. <laughs> Fine. What the? Go away! Why is he bothering us? Don't listen to her. You can stay. I mean, Seriously? Okay. You can dance with him. I'm gonna go get us drink. Could you bring one back for me, too? So it's up your friend. Is your girlfriend or something? Such a bitch. No, that's just not right. I, she's in love with me and she thinks we're dating and I don't even like women. How well do you really know her? Some kind of undercover cop to me. No, that is not a cop. She's really cool to get to know her. She hates me, doesn't she? No, she just got this You know what? That's right, you are annoying. So, uh, who's the girl you're with? It's one of my girls from the club. It's my job to take her out and show her a good time while she's in town. So she's an answer? Yeah, she's pretty good, too. Here you go. That'll be eight bucks. Keep the change. So, uh, you should let me get your number. I can take you out to lunch sometime. Um, I don't have a phone, but you know where I work, so you can always stop by. You know where I work. Where'd that guy go? If you want to spend time with him, I'll hang out at the bar. I'm cool. Ugh. I got so bored of him, and plus he thought you were an undercover cop. Me a cop? What an idiot. Why don't you just go back to the bar? Enough with these weirdos on the dance floor. Fine, but I want another shot. <laughs> of course. Come on, Ivy. Come on, show us your breasts. Don't be shy. I'm not like you. I like to keep a little mystery. And besides, my boss is sitting right next to us. It's only fair. We see Yen's breast every night, along with a lot of other women's. If my breasts were bigger, I would show them more often. Yen! Stop it! I don't want to show my breasts! Either you show them, or I'm going to rip your buttons off with my teeth. Damn it! You're not my shirt! Fine, fine, fine. I'll let you, I'll let you unbutton my shirt. Those breasts are beautiful. They're perfect. Yes, very beautiful. See, nothing to be upset about. My breasts are a natural thing. You need to learn to relax more, Ivy. Thanks. Okay, well, let's head to bed. And Ivy, you're sleeping with me tonight. Topless. As a matter of fact, you're not getting this back until I'm Good night, girls. I have a time to do work. I'll be in after I have a nap. Get this back tomorrow. Thanks. What if I get cold? I'll keep you warm. Okay, you two are in charge tonight. We're going out of town for a meeting. Ivy, I think you and Thomas can handle this. Uh, here's the keys. Left you a list of instructions in case you got any questions. Look, but Thomas is working with the floor and that's what needs to be done. Ivy, you're the acting manager tonight. Thomas will have the floor. If there's any problems with the girls, he'll handle it. Okay, cool. Is there anything else I need to know? Has the runner gone for stock or do I need to go? I mean, how are the things looking? Kitchen manager's already sent the runner and he should be back any minute with the stock. Ivy, I've got the procedures for closing the downstairs bar. Um, I'll be running the casino. We just need you to uh, supervise. Make sure those girls tip you. Make sure they take care of the house mother, too. Thank you. All right, sir. If I can just have you sign here and here. 
Thank you very much. And your funds will be available shortly, as well as your bottle of champagne. Thank you, darling. Have a seat, doll. I have champagne on the way. Oh, now you're talking my kind of language. Thank you, darling. Is there a possibility I can take her off the stage? I'd like to spend some time with her. I need to speak with Ivy about that, but I'm sure it's not a problem. I would just kind of like to request that Italian to take off the stage. Oh, absolutely. I can take her off for an hour. Thank you. I'd also like to know about a private room in about an hour. Absolutely, sir. Uh, yeah, I would like to. Would it, would it keep her off the off rotation? Yes, of course. Okay. If you guys are in the couch room, she wouldn't be caught to the stage at all. Thank you, Abby. You're such a sweetheart. Enjoy, sir. And if there's anything else you need, please don't hesitate to ask the bartender. Ivy, Ivy, something's got to be done. With that girl. What girl? Calm down. What are you talking about? It's Italia. She's in the couch room giving some guy a blowjob. Where's the floor guy? I tried to talk to him, but he won't do anything. Okay. We're gonna take care of it. Thanks. I mean, you've got to do something. The girls are gonna kick Italia's ass if you don't stop it. I'm on my way to handle the situation right now. Please just ask the girls. Okay, to I will let them know. Maybe I can stop the rest. Thank you. You see it? True? Yes. It's freaking disgusting. What are you doing? I told you I don't know how to handle the situation. What do you expect out of me? I don't come here for the shit. I what the I'm on my way to handle it right now. I'm sorry. Dad, zip it. Yeah, you should to drift. Why are you still standing here? This you, is your job! I told you I don't know how to handle the situation. This is how you handle the I'm so sorry to interrupt. You have a very important phone call. I'm so sorry, sir. She's gonna have to take a call. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell is going on? Where are you going with my money? Is she coming back or what? We're done here, sir. So you can get the hell out of the club. This is not the kind of place I'm running here. You paid $400 for lap dances? That's it. Hey, can you please let Scarlett know that I'm gonna send Italia home tonight? Have her sign a slip and I'm waving her tip-up piece. Just sending you home for the night. You can talk to the bosses tomorrow about working. And I've got a taxi for you. You're in no condition to drive to work. Okay, well, thank you then. Do you know why I'm sending you home? I think so. Tell you, I've got a club full of girls I want to kick your ass and leave because of your conduct. I'm really just sending you home for your own safety and the sake of the club. So, you're not firing me? don't have the authority to. I have to talk with the owner and the manager tomorrow in the morning. So, am I free to go? Uh, Italia, your uh, taxi's here. Um, it's free to take you. Good luck. No, 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 no. No kisses. No kisses. I love you, Ivy. Mama, I got your tip out for the night. Thank you. Well, maybe I could make some real money if these guys weren't so cheap. Oh, smile, and you look marvelous, darling. Thank you. I didn't make too bad yet because of what I tell you did. Go. Get out there and make us some money, sugar. 
Shut your shit, you're on stage. Fine, fine, I'm coming. Hi, Ivy. How's your night going? Now, why on earth did you wave a Taya's house season tip out? Why? On earth, Scarlet? Did you ask such a question? Why was one of the girls out on the floor in that condition? And where the hell were you? Oh, don't blame me for that stupid whore. You have one job. It's your responsibility to report back to me if there is any problem, if anybody is drunk or high and cannot work. Fine. I'll keep a better eye on them next time. Would Italia pull tonight could have had a shutdown or her ass in jail? Thanks. Stupid idiot. <sighs> Who in the world does she think she is? What is that stupid girl talking about? Well, I mean, what's good here? She shot her own boo in here. Girls and Thomas, we're officially done. Ivy, wake up. Yes. It's time for work. You're going to be late. Thank you. I'm coming. I got fresh orange juice and uh, coffee brewing for you in the kitchen. Good morning. What are you doing here? I do have keys to the place. There's a message from the boss. It's getting ready to get some paid. Okay. Feel free to read it. I will check it out as soon as I shower. Hello? I understand there were some problems in here last night. One small problem, but I think we were able to handle it. Thomas, stick around. You need to hear this. It's your responsibility to handle problems with the girls in the couch room, okay? Not Ivy's. She's not going to do your job for you again. Now, I watched the tapes. You're all right. You didn't do anything wrong. Thank you, sir. I thought I was doing the right thing. She's not going to do your job for you again, okay? I don't need her fighting in here. I need her in one piece. Let the other bouncers know that, too. Uh, yes, sir. I'll handle it. You know, one other thing. That dancer that comes in here on Xanax all the time, if she comes in here all zannied up one more time, she can get the hell out of my club. I'm going to let the manager know that, too. Oh, oh, her again. we got to take steps to stop the girls from doing so much drugs and getting drunk on the job all the time. Ivy, thank you for taking care of me last night. You're welcome. So they're gonna let you work tonight? Yeah. Good, I'm glad you didn't lose your job. Good luck. Wait, Ivy, I need you to hear this. I was really messed up last night. I know, that's why I sent you home. I had no idea what was going on. I'm sorry, but thank you. Well, I do care and it is my job. Nobody's ever taken care of me like that before. All right, cool. Make a lot of money tonight. Behave yourself. I will. What can I get you to drink? I'll take a double vodka and cranberry. Got it. Thanks, girl. Anytime. Ivy, this is Sarah. You may remember her as the woman that used to be uh, in a famous game show that we watched. Oh, wow. Nice to meet you. I remember seeing the game show as well as your movie. Yeah, it's like Very nice to meet you too, Ivy. I love what you guys have done with this bar. I remember that movie. Mm -hmm. It's wonderful. Yeah, it's one of the loveliest I've ever met. And you're from this area too. I sure am. And wow. when, when I'm not working, I'm usually in town. 
Great. Any words of advice? I could probably get into acting. Well, the only words of advice I can give are don't. It's a very, very hard industry to get into and you're really better off behind this bar. Oh, Sarah, why don't I show you around the place before you start gambling? Perfect. This is a fabulous establishment. And you have a wonderful bartender. Don't lose her. Well, Ivy's more than just a bartender. She's a prodigy. She's also one of my managers. She wears yeah. a lot of hats around here. Yeah. Any you ladies, anything else? Yes. Love a refill. Another shot. Thank you. Yes, I am. And it looks like it's uh, too late for me to work. Yeah, it's actually been slow. What are your plans? Uh, you, you are my plans. So, uh, what are you doing after work? <laughs> Whatever, you can do something. Okay, well, I'll just um, have a drink and wait on you then. Sounds good, we'll see you in a bit. Wait, I need to ask you a question though. Oh, yeah, I got it, I got oh. it. Okay. You need to let your girl Ivy know that I'm not such a bad person. Don't worry about it, babe. Ivy will completely understand. You know what? I, I can talk to her. It'll be fine. Wanna take a shot? Let's do it. Can I help you ladies? Have two shots, please. Yes, ma'am. First tab. He's already approved of it. Mm. Oh, here you go. All I can get was CK. Thanks. Hey, listen. I'm gonna be moving soon, and I haven't told Ivy yet. So. I need to ask you a huge favor. What is it? Anything. Okay. Um, just, can you keep an eye on her for me? Just, just look out for my girl. Yes, of course. I'm, I'm heading down to Florida and I've decided to get back with my boyfriend. And she doesn't know about it? No. So you guys aren't a thing? What? Wait, <laughs> wait a minute. You thought the two of us had something going? I mean, I kind of assumed, maybe. Whoa, yeah. whoa, whoa. <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean, I are just friends. I mean, I love to tease the shit out of her and all, but I don't even like her like that. I see you for her. You got a drink? Yes, sir. Who's your lovely friend? This is my friend, Nick. Yeah, it's nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you, too. Okay, I'm ready to dance, Kelly. Would you like a dance, sir? Darling, let's go. <clears throat> Am I interrupting something? Nope, just getting ready to close. Got sheets for me? Yes, I do. Great, thank you. What is up with these chintzy lines? Come on. It doesn't look right. Um, it looks like cocaine to me. You're just so freaking paranoid. She called it CK. Yeah, that's short for coke. Here, just give it to me. I'll be the guinea pig. Wow. <coughs> Whoa. Ugh. I don't know. Yeah, that's, um, that's cocaine. Just, that's plain old coke. You're sure? Yes, cuckoo crazy. Just do a line and let's go get a drink. Right. Just a little of that. Alright, hurry up and do your little crumbs. Come on. Okay. Alright, I need to go to the bathroom. Right. Let's 
go. What? What did, what did we just snort? <laughs> I don't know. I was I was thinking the same thing. Well, well what do we do? What do we do? Wait, well, let's, let's just calm down. Calm down. Let's have a drink and you'll be fine. <laughs> We're all going to be fine. Are you two okay? We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> you know you like it, Ivy. I have to go talk to Yin and uh, the bathroom. It's very important. I don't know what it is about you. You're just so irresistible. I'm done. That was absolutely disgusting, and they must be on drugs. Can you believe this just actually happened? I really can't. What's wrong with you today? <laughs> Ivy! Yeah, that lady looked upset. Oh shit, we gotta get out of here. Who to drive? Where do you you can go? drive. Somewhere to drink. Lord help me. <sighs> Enjoy your time off. I'll talk to you when you get back. Thank you. <laughs> Why are you making so much noise? Oh, sorry. Uh, it's time to go to work. I didn't mean to wake you up. You know, just. I guess I'll see you later. I'll see you there. Hey, and just uh, remember to lock the door on your way out. Okay. You know, I'm, I'm really excited about moving and just starting a new life. What makes you think it's going to be so much better this time? Listen, Ivy, we've both made mistakes. And I'm not completely innocent in this. I mean, he's in the Marines and he's gone all the time. It's just a hard relationship to be in. You know, shit happens. So what about us and our plans? This is supposed to be a new beginning for all of us. It is. It's going to be a new beginning for you and a new beginning for me. Why don't you just come to Florida? Come to Florida and do what? Well, for starters, you can come visit. And who knows, if you like it there, you can live there if you want. I have a job here. Besides, what could I do? And I need to move out of here soon. You are supposed to be my roommate. Last night. I don't ever want to talk about that again. That should have never happened. Why don't you just go out with us tonight? Oh, uh, why? I know it sounds crazy, but I really want the two of you to be friends. And listen, Ivy, he can never know about us. Me and him. Friends. What would you like me to say to him? Give him a chance. You'll like him. He's out of the service now and he's changed. Just quit being so damn jealous, Ivy. You know, I'm really not such a jealous person. But I did not like being drug around like a third wheel and somebody's fallback crutch at the end of the night. He's a cheater. And so am I. Listen, he's gonna be here later this evening and three of us are gonna go out. Ivy, you're gonna try X tonight. Ivy, we're celebrating. I tried it either. I'm not gonna take it. I don't want that. Yes, you do. It'll make you feel better. Happy, fun, relaxed. Not so uptight like you always are. Try it.
hummus. No, I hear it's like acid. I freaking hate acid. It's not like acid. It's like muscle acid. That's good. You're gonna try it. Mm. Yeah. All right, all right. Just take half for now. But trust me, you're gonna be begging for it later. You feel like dealing with me. You're gonna be Get us the hell out of here now. Where am I going? Just take a left. Just go. What the hell's going on? Somebody's freaking got killed. I saw the guy's face and he was going to kill somebody and anybody that got in his way. All right. Now, where am I going? What the Get hell? Get us out of here. Okay. So somebody is dead? Who is dead? Ivy. Someone's dead. Let it go. Now, where am I going? This is a joke. This is not happening. Probably more than one person got killed. Just, just go, go to Ivy's hotel. Let's just go. So this is it. I coke that out. Just need to give it a chance. Come on, get up. Get up. What about your man? He's in the other room. <laughs> He's passed out. He's not gonna care. <laughs> this isn't a good idea. <sighs> yeah. Have some coke. Oh. I'll help straighten you out. Good. <laughs> yeah, I need to get home. Ivy. Ivy. Ivy, wake up. Yin's yeah. here. She's packing her stuff and she's leaving. What? You have to get up. Yin's here and she's packing her stuff and she's leaving now. Ivy, we need to talk. What do we got going on tonight? Why don't you check on things in the kitchen and meet me in the office in an hour? Will do. Alright, let's get Corinne out and say it. No more sleeping with everybody, okay? I mean, the dancers, the wait staff, the bartenders. Enough is enough. What are you talking about? Look, the rumors are flying, okay? I mean, hell, you were at a rave the other night where somebody got killed. How do you know anything about them? Because I know everything you do. You can still have your fun, but no more partying with the staff. The dancer you're talking about is gone. And we were friends before we even came here. The girls are fighting over you in the dressing room. Enough is enough. I haven't slept with anything. 
Okay, good. Then go hang out with strippers from another club. Fine, find something else to do. Good, get back to work. We got people coming in for auditions. Yes, sir. You know that the story. The dog ate my rent money and my husband came home with the movers. He took everything. He even took the bed and all I have left is my pillow and a blanket. You would have missed me out of my car. I've dealt with it before, I'll handle it. Tell him not to come back until she gets to me now. Okay, I it. Time to go. Get the hell out of my car. Get your hands off of me. I didn't do a shit. You were sleeping again, and you're zanied out of your mind. I warned you. Hey, those are mine. Give it back. You don't look like Charles to me. Get the hell out. Come on. Are you Ivy? I am, and who are you? My name is Sid, and I was told to talk to you about a job. Um, I've never danced before, but it's my birthday, and this is something that I've always wanted to do. I, um, I don't have any money or any clothes, but I can get some as soon as I have some money. If you just please, please, please hire me, I really, really want to be your dancer. Let me see what I can do. you say it's your 18th birthday? <laughs> no, sir, but it is my birthday. Well, looks like today's your lucky day. You're hired. I am? Oh, when can I start? Start tonight if you wish. Oh, wow. Uh, uh, how often can I work? Every night if you'd like. Oh, my God. Okay, so I don't have any clothes, but um, if there's anybody here I can borrow some from until I get some money, I promise I'll buy my own clothes. I'll talk to the house mom to see if she can get some clothes for you. Ivy, why don't you show this young lady around? Certainly. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. I'll be right back with the paperwork. All right. I have a job. I'm off probation. Today is my birthday. I want you to get the hell out of my life. Stay away from me. I never want to see you again. Okay, if that's what you want. But you'll be back because you're a fucking failure. You heard me, lady. I never want to see you again. You were a poor excuse for a mother. Now get the fuck out of my life. Have a good night, everyone. Ivy, Ivy, the woman of the hour. How are you? Tired. Trying to stay out of trouble. How about you, Pablo? I'm fine, just fine. I was sent over to talk to you about something. Ooh, you work for the owner. So what I do now? No, no, no. You're doing a fine job. In fact, he has a business proposition for you. What's that? He wants you to be his girl. He'll give you three grand a week and free one of the club. As long as you're available when he needs you. Really? And why didn't he just come talk to me about that himself? That's my job. <laughs> well, I'm flattered by the offer, but really, I am not what he's looking for. He would be much happier with one of the dancers and any one of those girls would jump at the opportunity. You may be right. But hey, just keep this conversation between us. We're cool. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> you all business when it's all about business. You never break. I think I'm closing up. Want one more? Yeah, I'll take another. Okay. Here you go. Thanks. Have a good night. All right, I'll uh, put on the security system when you leave. Cool, thanks, I'll see you then. Good night, Ivy. Good night. Good night, Ivy. Good night. After the casino closed last night, it was robbed, and they took a substantial amount of money. What? Ivy, what time did you leave? Hold on, I'm going to ask some questions. Same time as the bartender closed the bar. Your assistant walked me out, set the alarm, everything. I lost the tapes. I saw it leave. Are you sure you didn't come back? What are you insinuating? Why don't you just come out and say it? And you know me better than this. How much money is missing? We have to ask everyone during this investigation. Over $100,000. Well? Did you come back after you left? No. 
And you damn sure know it wasn't me because I've been trusted with a hell of a lot more than $100,000. I mean, $100,000 for that, actually. She's got the deed. Now, my uh, partner's put her in charge of the building clubs. Never had a problem as far as money and I. Look, we have to ask everybody. Okay, you folks can go back to work, but uh, I need to speak with the other managers at this time. How am I supposed to just go back to work after that? You better start watching yourself. I told you not to trust those people. As soon as I left, the shit started, and I'm not surprised. My contract's up shortly, so I'm not renewing it. They don't pay me that shit. You need to come down here now before you end up in jail. Okay. Well, I'll see you in a couple days then. You can't go. You can't live with Yen. She doesn't love you. She doesn't care about you. She's just going to use you. Yeah, but it's not like that. I'm starting over. It's a new chapter, change of scenery. I have to leave here. Be good. What's wrong? I didn't make enough money tonight to make my child support. I'm sorry, girl. You'll be able to get it tomorrow. I can't. I'm $30 short and I have to pay it in the morning. I just really want to see my kids. Here, how's that? Thank you. No big deal. I'll never forget it. Don't even worry about it. Just go see your kids and have a good night. Thanks. last night. And it is. Gotta start over. Gotta get a new life. What will you do? I'll be in Florida. Do something. Good luck. So how was your night? Girl, I am so tired. <laughs> My feet are killing me. I'm ready for a drink. Yeah, we should go ahead and love all of them. Yeah. I'm gonna break my nose. <laughs> oh gosh, don't have a You're gonna be okay. <laughs> She's doing so much better. Oh my goodness. <laughs> we'll miss you. Oh, you behave. You better be home. Oh, <laughs> oh, we're gonna hit the club. Yeah, tequila time. <laughs> Here's your contract. Most of your point. Oh, well, thank you. Take care. Take care. Thank you. Like seeing you. Be good, guys. This is a lovely deal. I moved to Florida in hopes of starting a new life. I went down there with false hopes and false faith. I was thinking and dreaming. What I found Florida to be was one big rape club with broke homeless kids on ecstasy and retirees living off social security. I dreamed a dream that never came true and this is where my adventure begins. Take all my peace.
say 